My name is Stephanie. I'm 30 years old. Uh, for about a year and a half, I lived in Thailand while I was teaching English, but now I'm living in New Zealand. I grew up in a tiny little town in Wisconsin in the USA, and I never expected that I would be here or be in Asia, being able to kind of feed some elephants and just walk around with them and be a part of something that seems so much bigger than just me. when you notice the I know that some people think that any sort of tourist operation involving elephants is bad for them, but I think that places like the Elephant Haven and the Elephant Nature Park in Chiang Mai are probably the best option for elephants right now. Uh, living in the wild, it's so easy for them to get poached and people might use them for personal use, like that guy that I saw wandering the streets with an elephant just begging money and food off of people. Uh, in the Elephant Nature Park, they don't have to perform any tricks, they don't have to give anybody rides, they can just hang out and they can forage for food all day and go swimming in the water and be with their friends and that kind of thing. I just started thinking about the ways elephants were supposed to live and how people were treating them inhumanely, kind of like taking away their elephantness. So when I was thinking about going to see elephants, I looked into the most humane projects that were out there. So I went to the Elephant Haven, and it's a completely humane camp. Like, you don't ride the elephants, they don't do shows, you just kind of hang out with them while they go about their day. And most of the elephants there have been rescued from logging projects and uh, tourist camps and stuff like that. So they've been misused and abused, and some of them are blind and arthritic and have a hard time getting around. One of the best parts of the day was going down to the watering hole with the elephants. So we're following along with them. And then there's just kind of an opening in the trees. And you look down and you can see like a little sandy bank and then the water and stuff. So we follow them down the slope and they usually get in, or they got in the water before us. And uh, we had these little plastic bowls. And at first the, the mahouts were out there and splashing around and then they gave us bowls. So we could go out there and we were kind of throwing water at the elephants, like on their faces, helping them to cool down and that kind of thing. Uh, there was this little baby elephant, he was so cute. Uh, he was just kind of like playing and rolling around and uh, open his mouth so you could throw some water in and stuff like that. Uh, so that was definitely a highlight of the day. I never thought that I would be able to go into the water and splash around with the elephants. So it was definitely Part of a perfect part of the day.